As you watch this video, I don't see how these trees were standing. They were beyond dead, uh, especially here toward the end. I cut two that are uh, just a shell, basically. I mean, you can peel the wood slap back off of them. So I'll be quiet where you can uh, watch and enjoy the video and listen to the saw. That's the 500 that I'm running right there. Uh, if you need any tree work done, anything, uh, edge bushes trimmed, goodness, pretty water lines, whatever, uh, my email is right down below. Send me an email, man, and I'll come out and give you a quote on it. So uh, y'all have a great Friday and a good weekend. We'll catch y'all later. Later, taters. That's actually good that it hung up because 
I can reach up there with a mini and slide it out where it don't just break all to pieces. Make the cleanup a little bit easier. hit the ground so hard right there there's a lot of weight in that in that tree and didn't leave anything hung up up there either or broke so that's a good thing these trees here are uh, super 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 tall so that's uh four right there and then there's another crispy critter right there i'm gonna get it down too and put it on the ground I didn't cut that one off. I'm going to come back and cut it off with another saw. I didn't want to stick that chain in that because there's a lot of dirt been pulled up by those termites and ants and everything that's in it. So I just left it like it was. All these stumps will end up being the ground here too. I'll go ahead and cut that one at the 500. Get it sawed off. So believe it or not, there's still some holding wood right there on this tree. It's back leaning over my machine right there a little bit. The only thing I'm concerned with is when this top, I gotta get it, I gotta get it to fall right beside this pine right here because this top's gonna hit this mulberry or whatever that thing is right there and i don't want it to break and come back at me just compost is all that is just rotting and turning back into dirt
I was gonna cut that with a 500, but I'm gonna cut it with a 550. Man, that's just so dirty. probably got about four foot of back lean because straight up would be would be right there yeah it's gonna be at least four foot oh holding wood in it's pretty good it looks awful but uh i think it's gonna work we're gonna see what she'll do here I did center that little oak down there. It'll probably it's young enough. It'll probably be all right. Didn't hurt too bad. But uh, you can see what the hinge and all looks like. It didn't hurt anything up there. 